The first vertical rocket landing on Earth happened 20 years before SpaceX landed its Grasshopper rocket in 2013. But why NASA stopped developing a perfectly working prototype is not what you think. The Delta Clipper Experimental or DCX was a one-third scale prototype of a reusable launch vehicle developed by the Strategic Defense Initiative Organization in the early 1990s. Built entirely from commercial, off-the-shelf components, the DCX had demonstrated successful landings from altitudes of up to 10,300 feet. In the mid-1990s, the entire program was transferred to NASA, who was not particularly excited about it, since it wasn't their invention. NASA also has a preference for big and expensive R&D projects. The personnel from the original program were given a cold shoulder and swamped in bureaucracy. When the DCXA's fuel tank ruptured during a landing and burnt down, NASA chose not to rebuild it, which would have only cost about $50 million. Instead, they poured almost a billion dollars into the X-33 Venture Star spaceplane, which never took off. 